guys and welcome back again so we will be doing um, another video on pretty much finishing up I'm not gonna show like too much of me going up and down the stairs and back and forth stuff I'm gonna just take all my dolls and everything up and then just go from there I'm gonna get everything upstairs and then I'm going to um, start putting it where it needs to be showing you guys this and that so I'm gonna try to make this like my last video and then I can start doing content in there and yes I reached out to American Girl but unfortunately at the moment I guess I don't have too much of a following or whatever I don't even have a doll which I'm gonna work on that and get me some American Girl dolls but unfortunately they didn't want to work with me at the moment I was trying to see if I couldn't get on the PR list or whatever where they send you stuff in the mail um, it would have been really cool it's okay maybe one day in the future they can collab with me and send me a PR box who knows and I want to start going to the store and the store that's closest to me which is almost like three hours away pretty much but most people travel anyways <clears throat> to American Girl when I've been watching all these YouTubes about it YouTubers um, most people do travel but um, ours is in Dallas Texas so I hope to go there one day um, right now probably not right now but um, yeah but right now we're gonna go wash clothes and washing clothes will be like a little intermission and then we'll get back to our um, doll room doing all that so today's gonna be a busy day because I want to try to get everything upstairs where it needs to be and try to work with what I got and get everything set up and show you guys and start talking about my dolls and there's just a lot in store that I want to do and having a doll room and where I can go and show you guys my dolls and um, I'm just going to be getting my childhood stuff back and all this and that. I think that would be real cool. Um, I've had a rough life and I want to just get away from all that all the way get away from all the bad juju and just get back to where it's meant to be I didn't have a great childhood growing up but it wasn't terrible and then when I got out of high school everything just went sideways and you know I love doing YouTube and it's just shown me that even as an adult you can still have dolls you can still have doll houses you can do things I'm not the only one and yes I'm kinda on the fence about about it because I'm not confident I don't want people to judge me and this is something I could do in the own comfort of my own home and thank you to everybody that has subscribed we're getting there we're not there yet let's get to that 400 mark but um, this is what I do in the comfort of my own home. I collect dolls and I also collect other things too and you'll see it down the road too. But I don't want no judgments on my page because I'm a girly doing what I love and I'm gonna leave it at that. But yeah, I reached out to American Girl. Unfortunately, not right now, but maybe in the future. I need to start doing some content and talking about it and all that good fun stuff. Go to the store. But anyways, let's go wash clothes. Peace. All 
All right, guys, so we made it home from washing clothes. Now we're gonna put everything up and then I'm gonna start working on my doll room and get a little bite to eat because I haven't eaten anything today. So let's get going. This is our clothes. I gotta put it up. She's putting up the towels right now. All right, guys, so I'm gonna be taking all of this stuff down off my shelf, like everything, dusting it, cleaning it up, and um, then I'm gonna be putting everything over here except for the lamp is gonna be going over here. And then my Alice in Wonderland Scentsy is going upstairs and I'm bringing the other one down. So I got a lot to do. My sister's probably not gonna help me. She's gonna be outside with, excuse me, with the dogs, which is fine. I don't really want her to have to um, move my stuff when it ain't hers. I mean, I don't want someone to have to mess with my stuff and all that because it's not theirs and it's not fair to them. But that's okay because I'm wanting to do a doll room. So, you know, it is what it is. But in the future, she'll probably um, put some things up there Harry Potter wise and stuff. Actually, let me show you her video. Her video. <laughs> let me show, her, show you. I can't even talk today. Show you her room. Let's get it. And you're probably going to be hearing the fan. So, anyways. So this is her chandelier. Look how beautiful it is. I got her this for Christmas about one or two years ago. Probably two years ago. All of her um, Build-A-Bears. And the Harry Potter's actually from Home Depot. Then we had the Advent Calendar. I'm zooming in, but it's a little blurry. That's all of her uh, Legos from her advent calendar I'll just stay zoomed out then she got her sorting hat and then I got her mostly all of the uh, fungo pops she's gotten those two and then those dolls are from Walmart and then I got her this little poster and she had that poster already and then she has, there we go, that little poster. So all in all, she loves Harry Potter. Also her bed is the um, newspaper. And then that's from Cincy, a little buddy that smelled good. So yeah, she likes Harry Potter. Very different taste from me. Um, that's okay, but I like Harry Potter too. I just I like Not and All, Rainbow High, Cinderella, Strawberry Shortcake, Tangled. You know, that kind of stuff. But um, and I like a little bit of Bratz. I like Chloe and stuff like that. But enough of me rambling, and let's get it. And if y'all have never had a diffuser, oh my gosh, they're amazing. Hi, Mom. I got to show my pretty girl, sad, sleepy baby. She says, not today, y'all. Oh, and another thing about giving. I still got you. She loves when the diffuser is on. She will sit in the living room. She loves it. I don't know what, but I don't know if she likes the smell of it or what. But I'm going a little off topic, but I love our furniture. It's from Ashley's. Get a better view of it. This is our living room. And I just love her little cat area, what we did to it. I can't wait to decorate it in Hello Kitty. It's going to be fun. I am just obsessed with new things, decorating, all the good fun stuff. I love to just decorate. I just can't say it enough. She's got the dogs out. 
He's getting some water. Hi, Simon. He's doing really good just being in the fence, but I still don't trust the whole in the fence by himself thing. So get over here, Simon. Simon. Good boy. And then we got Cookie way over there. Get Hi, Cookie. There they go. Y'all behave. Anyways, she sits out here for the most part, but I'll sit out here too sometimes. Anyways, that's what we're doing, letting the dogs be out, and I'm going to go move everything because I don't want her to have to do it because it's not her stuff and it's not fair, so... I'm going to do it, and because I want the doll room, I'm going to do it. So, not further ado, let me get going with it. Peace. Took me a second because as I pulled them out, I dusted every single one of them. So we're going to start out over here. I got some Rainbow High Valentine's cards in their book. Yes, I thought the Valentine's cards were cute, so I wanted to get them and collect them. Then I got pictures and stuff that I will, artwork that I will put up wherever I put the dolls. Just kind of like a overview of all the dolls. She is absolutely so adorable. Look at her glasses. Oh my gosh, that's Piper. And this is one of the sleepover uh, non and alls. I need to get the other one. There's some of these that I need to complete, like all of their. Um, Sets. I need to get all the dolls and she has a another one and it's like a panda or whatnot and then this they have a cat so and that's like their little bedroom and then also with this one that's a sleepover she also has her own sleeping bag really cute and then coming on down here, these are all the um, plastic ones, and they're all mini none and alls. They're, see, they're plastic, and if you come over here, they're not plastic. They're cloth. So that was something different that none and all did, which I love every one of them. Then you come over here and we got the beautiful Irene. Hey girl. My beautiful baby doll. She was like 60 bucks y'all. Because people customize them to make them look real. And then of course I have my Build-A-Bear Hulk. And then I got this one from, I want to say Brookshire's. Love. I've had that Build-A-Bear for like ever. And then I got this one when I was working at McDonald's. It's a little Red Hulk. And then these are from McDonald's as well. And then these are from the Advent Calendar. And then this is Legos. And it's the Hulk. Oh my gosh. And then, bum ba da bum. This is my pride and joy. I had strawberry shortcake growing up with her little cat and then I had the yellow one which is lemon meringue with her little skunk and then the other two the purple haired 
is um, Rainbow Sherbert, and then the pink haired is Crep Suzette. And look how cute they are. And if y'all haven't seen me do the unboxing of all of them, her and her wasn't in a box. Oh, wait, I take that back. The two in the middle weren't in a box, the two on the outside were in a box. Super cute. Y'all should go check that video out. But look, y'all. I got it all up here, and I'm ready to start setting up. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to put probably them over here. So cute so far. And then figure out where everything else is going to go. Oh, my gosh. Like, I may put them up there first since they have the house and everything, pretty much. So, let's get into it. I'm so excited. So here's a little overview. It looks like they're in Paris in the city. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And as I get more, I'll rearrange, but for now, this is the look. And I put the tent and the camper down below, which that makes more sense. But this is a little overview, and I think it's so cute for my dolls. I will eventually get doll stand so they're not leaning up against the wall this is so so cute oh my gosh i'm obsessed and then my little hulk stuff i put it up right here my little hulk stuff i want to get some more hulk fungo pops and then as you go down the stairs you can see the hulks on the wall and the hulk pictures But super cool. I'm making the stairway and coming up and on the ledge, the Hulk area. And then I put my Rainbow High book right there and then the Valentine's cards right there. Again, this is turning out to be so adorable and I hope y'all are enjoying all of my not at all dolls. I'm not done. I want to get more, but this is turning out so cute in my little puzzle. And then I finally put up, after buying them like two years ago, we finally put up our mini ears. And then I'm probably going to leave my strawberry shortcake dolls on the bed for now because I don't know where to put them right now. And this is kind of what the bed is looking like. I'm going to put those up and then those. But yeah. This is what it's looking like. Nothing too crazy. It will be full eventually one day. But I'm loving my doll room. And then I got to fix all my fungo pops. But that's another time. But I'm going to finish putting up the rest of my stuff, organizing, all that good fun stuff, getting things where I want them, and that's about it. I hope y'all enjoyed this video of me doing my doll room. I showed y'all the majority of it that I wanted to show y'all. I will be doing some more things to it, and then I will do a whole tour of the doll room, but I just wanted to put that out there and show you my ideas and thoughts and what I got going. Most of my dolls 
Well, let's say all of my dolls except for four are not an all surprise dolls and I'm super obsessed with them. And I do plan on getting American Girl dolls. I want to get all the historical ones first. Even if they're retired, I will find them like on eBay or whatnot. And yes, guys, they're expensive. So we're going to have to work on that. Got that noted. And um, I also want to get Rainbow High and Shadow High. And then, you know, my Disney princesses are um, Cinderella and Rapunzel. And then also, like, of course, Alice in Wonderland. So, everything that I like, I'm going to collect it. And I'm going to collect my childhood stuff. And it's going to be a big playhouse. And it's going to be fun. And I hope y'all enjoy my content because it's going to be so fun. To just come hang out with me and talk about toys and dolls and all that good fun stuff. So, until next time, we'll catch you on another video. Bye. Peace. Okay, guys. We did something a little different. These are actually from my wedding shower that we hung up. Um, they were on our tables and stuff. It was like a little table topper, but yes. I thought it added a nice little touch, brought it all together. How precious. Just show you everything one more time. I'm loving my doll room and I can't wait to do more things with it and do like scenes and skits and all the good fun stuff. But yeah, I wanted to show you these little cutie things that I hung up they're like little well my sister said they could be like little pink little clouds but super cute y'all oh yeah